Oh yeah, awesome flow. All right, repeaters, back at HydroCut, finally again on the Glasgow side after uh, they did a bunch of maintenance a few weeks back. So let's see what we're dealing with. Oh, that's cool. They've made a few new rollers and stuff. <laughs> Good warm up. Yeah. Oh, I love it, back in the hydro car. So good. Oh, new rut. Hit the pedal. Classic hydro cut. Love it. That's a new one.
Okay guys, we're hitting Frankenstein, one of the more advanced trails on Hydrocut. A lot of switchbacks, but some uh, great descents. So you gotta earn it for sure, because you're gonna climb a lot, starting in about a minute. Maybe I should drop a gear here. Or is it too late? It's hard to tell. Cause I want a gear I can hammer in, but not too tall that I'll stall out. Not too short that I'll spin out. See how this goes. Okay, so far so good. <laughs> kind of uh, surprises you coming to that corner. And climb. I'm out of the saddle. Yep, I got it. Take the low line instead of the high line. A lot of them will send you on those ascents and then switch you up to a big switch back. You gotta climb again. And you gotta get your front wheel carving a decent art around those roots. <laughs> this is fun. It's really important on that whoop to look up as you saw because there's trees coming out the top end. If you're not careful, you're gonna slam right into them. You gotta thread the needle to get by that. There's a left-hander coming up here, back into the woods, where there's two solid lines. One will take you up a feature. The other one is flatter, so. Since it's blind, I'll probably take the flat one. So after this ride, I'm gonna continue driving west to London, Ontario, visit my brother, and we're gonna ride Bowler Mountain, my first time there. So consider this a warm up. Get the legs loose. I'll go hit Bowler. Should be fun. Oh yeah! So note to self, stay high going into that. Okay, here, gotta be careful. With the back wheel washing out. Don't want to lock it up in these turns. Not a lot of room. But yeah. Like that. <laughs> Do you hear that? Ah, a little drop there. Hit that nice. 
Oh, I missed that one. There's that drop I was telling you about. This is cool though. Here on this line, I like to stay high right over these rocks, like this. It sets you up way better going into this section. A lot of fun, a lot of roots. So, gotta hang on. Oh yeah, awesome flow. Can hit this gap that's coming up. Right about there. Small gap. And right about here is where you chill out. I got out of that bridge. Can be a challenging section. We call this Andy's BBQ Run because Andy's one of the guys at King Street Cycles who helped do a lot of maintenance on these trails. When they do a trail day, often they'll bring a grill and all the volunteers get a nice barbecue lunch. Thanks Andy, thanks King Street. Thanks Ziggy's and all the other bike shops for making this possible. Waterloo Cycling Club, of course. Volunteer organization extraordinaires. They are making it happen so that we can enjoy it. Okay guys, thanks for joining me on this video. It's been a good ride. Catch you guys on the next one. Get out there, get on the trail, it's beautiful. Take care and remember, as always, you are what you repeat. Bye.